welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new here welcome you're here with emmy or susul nubu which is similar for hello baby we're not going to waste any time today we are just going to get straight into the gameplay so everyone in the household is asleep oh maddie just woke up just in time mad nicely done ren's still asleep he's in his little hut that we made for him when i last played with you guys and he is so content he's just a sweetheart such a lovely addition to the ranch i feel like sheriff is sound asleep there's something about sleeping sims like it just oh it feels so wholesome i love it so I can't see Kid and Lily anywhere. I'm telling you now, if they've left the ranch, I'm gonna be fuming because I put everything into caring for these these little things and they just threaten you all the time. Like, there's not enough care on this ranch. I'm gonna leave. Don't leave because it hurts my heart. I don't want anyone, especially my Sims, to feel like they aren't loved, you know? like i'm quite a caring person and it, it breaks my heart that my animals don't feel loved in this game like what more can i do what do you want maddie is cooking up some breakfast i hope she's not cooking just for herself i hope she's gonna cook for the rest of the crew and by the rest of the crew i mean ren ren's up bright and early no school for ren today because it is a saturday so let's see where the day takes us it could be that we go on a little family outing just to sort of oh kid is thinking of leaving soon due to inadequate care see what i mean i don't want to hire a ranch hand because i just feel like i'll have let myself down if i do so i might get ren to clean them okay there's lily she's unhappy because she's dirty so what we'll do is we'll get ren to hmm can he Oh, I don't think he can because he's a child. What we'll do is locate Kid, seeing as Kid's the one threatening us. He just doesn't seem to be about and I, I just, it's such a big area and like, how am I supposed to find him, you know? Anyway, I'm sure he'll show up at some point. Let's just keep Maddie cooking for now. Oh my God, she only made food for herself. Uh, excuse me, you're a mum now. So for those of you that haven't been here for this kind of storyline, it started out with Madeline Caldwell, our main character, um, and Sheriff. So they're the OGs. Oh my God, why is Sheriff in Ren's room? I didn't know they could get in houses like that. Ren, you're gonna have a tough time getting out. Okay, that's fine. We'll just defy the law of physics and walk through a horse that's great oh no you're gonna have to get scolded for that babe i'm sorry but we're not we're gonna we're gonna raise you to be super super nice so we're gonna discipline recent behavior in a calm manner of course and ask him not to make a mess because it's just rude to be frank with you ren it's just a bit rude oh i do this every single time like every time i sit down to record i'll press m instead of the arrow and it's super frustrating like so much is happening can you see and i can't see anything Ugh. and it takes ages as well oh she's reached parenting level two that's sweet let's have her go find kid and lily and give them some loving there's lily she wasn't too hard to find hi babe i'll feed and clean because she's not happy because she's dirty so we'll do both and then we just need to find kid last episode it was lily now it's kid anyway as i was saying if you've not been here for like the storyline i guess of what's been going on so we started out with maddie and sheriff and then ren showed up at our house at like half past nine at night by himself and i just thought i can't be having that so i let him in after that episode you guys were like oh my god you need to adopt ren and i really wanted to adopt him as well so we did i cheated but we got him into the family and that's that's all we needed so now we have maddie ren lily kid and sheriff so we're quite a big family but it works it really truly works see ren's like making his own food he's like do you know what you took me in when i needed you the most who am i to ask for a bit of toast 
that rhymed that's so embarrassing uh, stop it time to feed kid there he is where have you been you little rapscallion come here and then this this grass is this all okay yeah it seems okay come on mads we need you down here kids threatening to leave oh don't get too close sheriff he had a negative encounter with one of them so i'm a bit wary when he's around them i think it's time to give sheriff some love and affection now because he's very prone like i said in the last episode to feeling depressed and I think it's because he's needy like if he doesn't get his needs met he gets really upset about it which honestly same so we're gonna brush his coat scratch his neck see how he's doing and just have a little check in with him really oh i love them they are honestly my favorite pair and by far this is my favorite family that i've ever played with oh maddie maddie needs to go to the toilet so we are gonna cheat because i just don't have time we've got so many other things to look after and maddie i'm sorry but if i can cheat i'm going to okay where's ren off to you're not in school today babe so don't be going anywhere too far oh look he's mopping up where he made a mess and this is what calm parenting does look at that maddie you're just on it see what i'm saying about it just working like everyone seems to get on apart from sheriff and lily sheriff and lily aren't really the best of friends i'm gonna get maddie to do some cleaning and just some refilling of things and then i'm thinking maybe some gardening we'll sell all seeing as that's you know we're kind of it's not great quality but we can sell it nonetheless i just love how happy they all are like i've never had a happier family there's always something afoot with these sims but with this family it just seems super chill like everyone likes each other everyone gets on and yeah we live a happy life on this ranch i can't lie sheriff always keeps us company while we're gardening as well and i just love that i think it's so cute i'm gonna change maddie's outfit i think i'm gonna take them on a little ride together i think i'm gonna get maddie to ride sheriff and then i'm gonna get ren to ride sheriff as well just to give them something to do first of all but also to give sheriff a good run around and maddie has come so far she gets up on the horse like nobody's business i don't know what she's doing here but <laughs> hot to trot would it be safe to say that she likes horse riding yes it would it would be safe to say that hopefully she's not got this sad look on her face because last time when they were riding look at her she's like a pro look at that stance that face she's like throw anything at me throw anything at me and i'll take it i love it i'm so happy because for those of you that weren't here when we first started this she um it must just be a thing with the game or maybe she in particular doesn't like horse riding but she was just super nervous on him and yeah it was just a bit of a nightmare to watch to be honest because you want your sims to be having a good time and let me tell you now for free maddie was not but she seems to be now look at this they're on an intense ride her legs are down by the side of sheriff like calm as a cucumber calm as a cucumber cool as a cucumber oh i love it it's so sweet let's go back to the house i think what we should do is get Ren Ren's still playing with his dollhouse what an absolute sweetheart i'm so happy we adopted him he's got no homework he's done it all oh he's got a drawing for his first day of school let's put it up in his room that's adorable oh is this his homework do homework come on ren you can't be playing with your dolls when you've got homework to do i'm super like really want ren to do well in school he's super good at riding horses so maybe he's got a career in being a ranch hand or something i'm definitely going to use him as a ranch hand as he gets older because he loves the animals and he's really good at riding sheriff i think his horse riding skill is at like seven he's doing really well look at him he's just reading and giggling he's like ha 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 homework is so funny i can honestly say i've never felt that before but okay and then i think we'll get him to do some painting because oh maybe he can't oh he's too small what about the guitar hire a guitarist we're not doing that what about the violin practice yeah we'll have him practice the violin i just want him to feel like his dreams are gonna be easy to obtain you know like whatever he wants to do 
I want him to feel like he can do it. So yeah, let's change Maddie into a hot weather outfit because it's getting hot in here. Oh, hi, Lily. Welcome. Oh, I love this outfit. I love this outfit. She looks so cute. I think we should have a barbecue. What are we gonna grill? For some reason, I always like going for the most expensive stuff. So sausages and peppers it is. Here she comes. Oh, she looks so cute. I love a backless dress, to be honest with you guys. I love a backless dress. I think it's so stunning. We're gonna have to call everyone to eat. I wonder if I can feed Sheriff from the table. That would be cute. <gasps> we're gonna pack it into a picnic and we're gonna have it somewhere. Pop it in here. <gasps> I love how the lid closes when you put the food in. I'm sorry, I'm so easily impressed, but oh my God. Put in inventory. Okay, and now I want Ren and Maddie to just go somewhere far away on the ranch. Basket. Oh. Oh, does it need to be on a table or something? Because we don't, we don't have one of them. Let's get a bench. One sec. Okay, now we can have the picnic. I'm happy about that. I think that's very sweet. What a lovely little area we've just set up there. Fantastic news. Put it on the table. Oh my god. That is so cute. Set up picnic. Come on, Mads. Don't be focusing too hard, my darling. Don't want to hurt yourself. <laughs> oh my god me and Lux laugh so much about how much my laugh changes I have a different laugh every day it's like I get possessed oh look that's so cute <gasps> Ren's acquired the violin skill well done Ren oh Sheriff's coming over he wants some of these sausage and peppers oh here we go guys I'm so excited for him to be having a picnic together oh look oh I love them they're eating at the same time. Stop it. This is adorable. They're just having a little picnic together and it's so, so sweet. My heart can't take it. I know I've said this about a million times in this episode, but I'm just so happy we adopted Ren. I genuinely can't imagine this game without him now. Oh, Mads. She looks so proud and happy to be his mom. Oh, we have a visitor. Hello. Hold on a sec. I'm sure Ren's surname is Grove. <gasps> Guys, it's Ren's mum. Let's invite her in. This is going to be a little bit strange, to be honest. I mean, she's either going to acknowledge the fact we've adopted her son, or she's not, and it'll be fine. Who's this now? She's walking over like she's going to beat us up. I feel like Ren's mum's brought Danny as security. I'm a little bit concerned. Let's do a howdy introduction. One of my faves. Oh, cute. Okay, I think we've had enough of that. Maddie, no more. Um, discuss horse riding. Oh, it's all kicking off. Now Caleb wants to go out. Let's go to the festival and buy one. I don't think I want to get bit is what I'm going to say. Uh, cancel. Yeah, cancel. No, 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 no. We've got drama on the ranch. We've not got time to be going buying t-shirts with a vampire. Discuss if the chicken came first. Okay, we're getting off to an all right start. Deep thoughts. Why did you leave your son to just come to my house at half past nine at night? That's what I want to know. That's my deep thought. Oh my God, is she going to Ren? I think she is. She's going right to Ren, I believe. <gasps> she just gave him a gift. What was it? Ren just got a special neighbourly gift from Juniper, an apple. That's it, an apple for your son. I'm all about healthy eating and promoting healthy eating with your children, but you're just gonna give him an apple. You've not seen him for five days. And now you're playing on the computer. It's Ren's computer. No, I think, I think you should go, Juniper, because I'm getting a little bit angry at you. Just go away. That's a mod, by the way, guys. If you want me to link it in the description, let me know. Um, but it's a mod that if, you know, there's Sims everywhere or whatever, and you don't want them to be, you can tell them to just go away, and they do. I think Maddie should do some cross-stitching for now because that was pretty intense. I mean, the Sims didn't show it. Do you know what I mean? They were fine. I was a little bit under pressure in that situation. I didn't know which way it was gonna go. I didn't even know if she would acknowledge that. Like, is the game clever enough to do that? I'm not sure. So I was a little bit tense. 
but it's okay because we're gonna do some cross stitching now and everything's gonna be fine i'm gonna check on ren though where's ren came with his dollhouse again stop it sheriff is sad he's fine with his hunger and everything he's just feeling a little bit low so let's have ren go and cheer him up i did say they were gonna go for a ride together actually so i think maybe it's time for them to go for a ride we'll leave those guys to do that and here's maddie with her cross stitching very relaxed this is what we need just some maddie time it gets a little bit overwhelming i feel like for her at the end of the day it all comes down to maddie done it and like again who looks after maddie me oh look how happy she is she's just always so unfazed by anything that happens their sheriff and uh, and ran off on their little wander there we go you can see him there through the window cutie pies oh i just love it i know it's relaxing for her but it's also very relaxing for me it's my therapy i feel like just watching her cross stitch i think what we'll do is cook some tea for everybody oh she's watching the telly while she cross stitches mood i'm also thinking about streaming guys i don't know how you guys feel about that you'll have to let me know in the comments but i'm thinking of streaming like maybe going live on tiktok because i'm nearly at a thousand followers on tiktok now on my new account i think streaming is next on the list but let me know in the comments what you think and if you do want to see me streaming what kind of streams do you want to see hey maddie's maddie's getting good at cooking you know the way she chops that asparagus then fantastic while that's cooking oh they're back that's good then oh and sherry's feeling much better oh nearly bit his hand off sheriff you've got a massive mouth maddie is feeling energized which is not great because it's 11 o'clock at night where's the food that she just cooked maddie where's the food that you are oh, there it is <gasps> that looks lovely here comes ren confident as anything oh i love that i love how confident he is especially for someone so young i feel like this part has just been these guys eating together but it's very cute. Ren, where are you going, babe? You need to eat. He's going watching the telly, isn't he? He's taking it to his room. <laughs> are we dealing with a teenager here? All right, just eat it outside. That's all right, Ren. It's a weird preference. You just do you. Yeah, I think it's time to start settling everyone down to bed. My favourite time of the day is bedtime and I hope my sims feel exactly the same. So let's get Ren down to sleep. Ren's finished his food so that's good. We'll get him down to bed after he's been to the toilet and then we'll get Sheriff and Maddie down. Kid and Lily are already asleep. I feel like they sleep a lot these two. Time for Maddie to sleep. Usually I'd get Maddie to put Ren to sleep. But he's so confident in himself now that he's absolutely fine to just go out to his little hut and put himself to sleep. Oh, like ships in the night. Look at them crossing each other. Bad luck to cross on the stairs. They've done it now. Don't even want to know what's coming in the next episode if they've just crossed on the stairs. Okay, that is everyone asleep and in bed. So I'm going to go ahead and end the part here. I hope you enjoyed it. I'm not sure what's coming in the next episode. I think maybe in the next episode it's time to start finding Maddie a partner. I'm super excited about that. Another addition to the ranch. Can I handle it is the question. But I'm sure we'll be fine. I'm sure we'll be, <laughs> we'll be fine. Thank you so much for watching. Toodles and I will see you in the next one.